is making pleasure to discuss with you about an important subject related to our work of publication of research article uh, or review in any international or local journals which is regarding ethics, misconduct and plagiarism. So what we will discuss in this lecture about definition and objectives, forms of misconduct and the details of it, how to avoid misconduct and some examples or cases. So let us start with definition. It is a scientific moral that made to differentiate between the right and false, acceptable and unacceptable, principles, values and morals. So the objectives is for the researchers to protect them from plagiarism and scientific misconduct, which is a very serious problem for if it happen. In terms of research, promote the aim of research, knowledge, and decrease the errors as much as possible, as well as to build the trust. In moral terms, strengthen the relation between the collaboration and the cooperation depends on the values and principles. Trust is very important, mutual respect and accountability. In support terms, in support, the public like to finance the research that can trust the quality of such research. Of course, research grant is very important. So what, is, what about ethics, principles, honesty, integrity? So, for example, the copyright is very important as part of intellectual property rights with respect to some classes in tribes. tribes. So, copyright, so we must keep the copyright uh, low. So, for example, if we take a figure from any paper, we must take a permission in advance, otherwise you cannot take a figure from any paper, it will be misconduct. So after taking permission, then you should also refer to the reference. No excuses in such cases. So this is why we call it responsibility. And this built up the trust of the scientist. What about falsification, fabrication, plagiarism, ghostwriting, plagiarism fabrication, these are really very bad mistakes. What means fabrication? Making up data or results and reported them. What about falsification? It is a manipulating of research, material, equipment, data, processing or results. Plagiarism is a very serious problem as well. Take over other ideas or data without giving him appropriate credit. Biliagrism fabrication, take over unrelated figure and put it in new publication. Serious problem. self biliagrism various publication with the same content but with different titles. Ghostwriting, someone other than the author makes a major contribution. Unapproved authorship, put someone as an author without his or her agreement or not consulted on his or her authorship. Correction authorship, giving authorship for individual due to their positions. And how to avoid scientific misconduct? It is very important to avoid fabrication and falsification of data. Search into your soil before research to avoid voluntary and involuntary plagiarism. No harm, avoid selective data tries. Think in advance of science first, then yourself to avoid hiding your actions. Don't disclose preliminary data to press or media to avoid the ghost and gift authorship. Of course, also there is Islamic instructions in general, search on your morals and ethics and all will be perfect for you. There is some examples even in politics about German education minister, minister 
go it's over PhD bilagrism also about the defense who also doctrine of bilagrism and to impose the governmental president Ma Merkel accepted the resignation so you see it can be really serious problem in our paper before we submit any paper you must check the bilagrism for example this paper in advance it was 63 imagine if you publish this paper it will be serious problem so after you are sure about all the data they are correct also remember to make uh, a checking of the bilagrism using official uh, uh, programs to be sure about the percentage before you publish your results thank you for your kind attention and I wish you all the very best.